Hello everyone, it's Angela O'Hare, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm over here in the newest community in Summerlin in the Kestrel Village or Kestrel Commons Village called Nighthawk by KB Homes. They just opened up uh, sometime in December and shame on me for getting these videos out to you so late. I had a very busy December time frame. But this is part of what's called the Kestrel Commons Village, and it is a newer village here in Summerlin. It's similar to the Red Point Square Village. So this community has 192 lots with six different floor plans to choose from, and three are modeled. Um, we are gonna take a tour of the 2466 floor plan, which is actually one of the most popular floor plans by KB Homes. Now, this one, the 2466, is actually 2466 square feet, two story with four to five bedrooms, two and a half to four baths, and a two car garage. So, as you walk in, you have your gar garage entry and also a hall closet. Now, with this floor plan in particular, you have an option of creating this downstairs room. You can leave it as a den or you can convert it into a full bedroom with a closet. And this is the sales office right now. And then this would be a full bathroom, or you could have it as just the den. Looks like they went with um, engineered luxury vinyl, sorry, luxury vinyl flooring. And then you have the stairs right there. Again, this is the most popular floor plan by KB Homes. They sell a lot of the 2466. A lot of people like this layout. Now in this community, there's two HOAs and it is gated. You have the Nighthawk HOA of $85 a month and Summerlin West of $55. SIDS are $280 semi-annually. Lot sizes are anywhere between 3,200 to 5,800 square feet. And just FYI, they have sold three lots since they've opened and they have 13 lots available right now. Now the lot premiums also can vary between 3,000 to 60,000 depending on the lot size and the location of the lot. So I like it, it has this nice big pantry. Looks like they went with the updated shaker cabinets. with the soft close, if it'll ever close. You have your microwave oven and then a double oven here. Quartz countertops with a double basin sink. Now, because this is a new community, everything's gonna be built from ground up, okay? So let's take a look at this lot size. pretty small, but because this is part of the Kestrel Commons Village, the lot sizes in this community are going to be much smaller than anywhere else because it wants to, they want to put as many homes as they can and um, etc. So, but you do have beautiful views of the strip. Now this lot premium would be pretty high. However, also you are going to have another community right there. So that's something you have to think about when you're paying for that lot premium. This is the first community that has opened up in Kestrel Commons. There's going to be another community called Viero um, by Woodside Homes, which will have two and three story homes and they will open up soon, hopefully. But when you buy from ground up, you're going to have to select everything. And what that means is the entire house is going to come carpeted and the only areas that has either tile is going to be your entryway, your kitchen, in your bathrooms and laundry, basically all your wet areas. You're gonna to go to the design studio and pick out all your upgrades. But before you do that, you have to pick out what's called your structural options. And structural options can be anywhere from adding the fireplace for, or adding a bigger slider or adding the barbecue stub in the backyard or adding an extra garage. Once you pick those structural options, options you're going to make an appointment to the design center and you go and pick out your cabinets your countertops your flooring and your appliance package and then you're also going to have what's called an electrical package where you get to decide if you want to put can lights over the island if you want to have it pre-wired for ceiling fans in every room 
Now in here, the great room and primary bedroom will have pre-wire for ceiling fan. Every other room or the other rooms, you will have to pay extra for that. So in the end, it starts adding up when you buy um, a new construction home and you have to pick out your options. Typically people spend up to, if not more, 10% of purchase price on their options. So when you come up with this floor plan to the left is gonna be your primary bedroom and laundry room. And then to the right, you have a, a good size loft. I've sold this floor plan a couple of times last year. So here's one of the bedrooms. It's a decent sized bedroom. This has a twin size bed, and then it also has a nice walk-in closet. The base price of this model is at 564,990. That is just the base price, and that does not include any lot premiums or upgrades. So this is a decent sized room as well. I like that they use the same flooring as downstairs, and I like that there are double vanity. Now this countertop, which is quartz, comes with the house, and it looks like they use the generic builder grade tub shower insert that comes with the house as well. So they kind of show you what you can do to uh, make the home nice, but without spending a lot of money on the upgrades. And then this looks like it's the biggest room out of all of them. You have a beautiful queen size bed with the two vanities and a walk-in closet, good size walk-in closet. Look at that view of Red Rocks. Eventually there's gonna be stuff here. I have no idea what yet. Um, so it'd be interesting to find out. Oh, I apologize. This is where this community is gonna be right here. Um, they haven't built much of it yet though. That's where Nighthawk's gonna be right there. They will also have a community park in here as well when you walk in. The upstairs laundry room for your washer and dryer. And then your smart panels right here as well. Linen closet. I like the double French doors. I like this design on the tray ceiling is beautiful. A nice size master bedroom, sorry, primary bedroom. Then you have a closet, you should be have a closet right here, which is actually a generous size as well. And then the um, primary bathroom, which looks like they probably went the whole generic route. The same countertops as the secondary bathroom, the same cabinets as throughout the house. And it looks like they did also a quartz um, shower insert. I like the black accents though. And then your toilet area. So to summarize, I'm over here at Nighthawk in the Kestrel Commons Village. We are taking a tour of the 2466 floor plan, which is 2466 square feet. And it has two stories, four to five bedrooms, two and a half to four baths, and a two car garage. The base price is at $564,990. So if you're thinking about buying new construction in Summerlin or anywhere in Vegas, I'm your new home sales expert. You can reach out to me at 702-370-5112. I sell a lot of new construction in Summerlin. Um, let me know in the comments what you think of this floor plan and this location. And make sure you know what to do, right? Like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next one.